Herod lied to these men, telling them that he was also interested in worshiping the baby king, when in fact his only interest was to kill the boy. Now, when Herod was outwitted by the Magi, as the Apostle Matthew tells us in his gospel, he was enraged. He ordered that all baby boys ages two years and younger be slaughtered in the regions surrounding Bethlehem in an effort to kill the baby Jesus. Well, unbeknownst to Herod, Jesus' earthly father, Joseph, had been warned in a dream to take his family and flee from Bethlehem and escape to Egypt with his wife and infant son. Well, the Holy Family narrowly escaped Herod's wrath and the Lord Jesus survived the slaughter. Now, Herod was unsurprisingly a madman with numerous interfamily scandals and a possible history of mental instability himself. In the same year that he killed the infant boys of Bethlehem, Herod himself would die, replaced by his son Herod Antipas, who would oversee part of Jesus' execution trial 30 years later.